So, I'm in Ljubljana airport, waiting for my flight to Paris. Two and a half hours left. So yeah, I have to wait. And after two and a half hours, they go there. So yeah, guys, I'm in Ljubljana airport, and we are heading to Paris. Charles de Gaulle. So yeah, let's go and see how the trips look like. So yeah guys, I'm on the way to Paris airport and I'm looking for some drink to buy. What do we have while we wait for the airplane because I have like two hours wait of waiting, left of waiting. So I'm looking at uh, different wine spirits. Uh, the cheapest wine you can find here, Slovenian wine, is about seven euros. And the cheapest, like, strong drink, about 20 euros so far. So yeah, let us continue looking and see what I can find. So yeah, still searching for the, that special thingy. See the Mexican skull? <laughs> it's 40 euros. Uh, but Finlandia vodka is like 15 euros. And if you want some rum here, about 40 euros. That's still too much for me. Man, I'm about, I don't know, 10 euros would be okay. These Chivas bottles would also be okay. <laughs> oh, but yeah, I'm not really a whiskey fan, so. But uh, I am a cognac fan, I must say. But yeah, about 25 euros for whiskey, so. 15 euros for vodka, Finlandia, and 15 euros for rum, Captain Morgan's, Jameson's 25, Metaxa for all you Greek lovers there, 18 euros, or Chivas, that actually is not a bad choice for, but it's 35 euros, you know, but it's one liter, I think. Uh, if I bought it, I would bring it to France, but then the next day I would have to re-enter the airport and they would take it away because I would not drink it also. That's not an option. So yeah, I guess no booze for me, yeah? <laughs> How much is Sierra Tequila, Tequila Guerrilla? So Sierra Tequila is about 20 euros. Smirnoff Vodka, 23. Bacardi, 20, and so on. Maraula, that's a nice one, but 25, that's too much. So, yeah. Mm. I guess we go back to wine selection. Gordon's Gin, that's like the cheapest, like 12 euros, so. Yeah, but you don't have tonic here, so I couldn't mix it. So, let us check out the, the wine selection again, and maybe pick up one wine for the time we wait here. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolates. Yeah, wine regions of Slovenia. So, where did I see that cheap wine? I don't know, you don't believe me, but it was like six euros or seven euros, something like that. It was somewhere here, no? Now I'm confused. I think it was somewhere here. No, it was somewhere in the war, there, more there, more here. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Now I lost it. Eh, I found it. There. You don't believe me? Seven euro. Ah, it's Svicek. So, <laughs> the most <laughs> famous Slovenian wine. Svicek. But only 0.7 for seven euros, guys. But I found, I found some Pinot Grigio there for seven euros as well, I think. Oh, it was 10 euros, okay. No, I'm sure I found it for seven before. Oh, did they change the prices <laughs> between now and then? <laughs> okay, so you have Pinot Grigio for 10 euros, like. And this is a good one from it's next to Hungary, Jerusalem, Ormash, 11 euros. It's a good one, I know it. I buy it in the shop, but 
as you know, prices are more expensive in the airport. So, so either we go for Cvičak, uh, and there it ended. So, bum 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 bum. We have Cvičak. We have Georgian jo Gordon's jean there, or I don't know what. No, that one, yeah, Cvičak is the same there. Uh, Maybe I go for Cvičak. Choices, choices, choices. So I'll go for 6 euro 90. Cvičak 1. We go to pay and then we go to wait for our plane to Paris and continue our, our journey to Africa, 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 Africa. So stay with me until the end. Take care, guys. We have also a nice food selection here at the bistro or the duty free from about 20 euros for a big pizza to a special sandwich there for 15 euros. Or like this one for eight, nine euros. So yeah, that's the duty free of Slovenia, Ljubljana Airport. And now guys, I got my ice, I got my wine, and we go to enjoy it here in duty free. Since we have lots of such tables, you just choose a chair, pull up a chair, and wait for your airplane. So yeah, see you guys after I finish. This puppy up. Yeah. So the wine called Svicek. Beautiful dry Slovenian wine. It's supposed to have healing effects. It's like uh, lowers your cholesterol level. Uh, and it's generally good for your health, for your digestion and stuff like that. It's a mixture of white and red wine, which is not usually found in the world. It's very dry, so it's sour, but yeah, it's good, it's good. Going to prove it, I will prove it to you. <laughs> nice, dry, sour. Perfectly chill and a little bit fuzzy. You can feel like um, oxygen inside, you know, the little oxygen bubbles. Yeah. So I made it to my checking gate <laughs> on the monitor. I just saw it was closed and I ran there up to the stewardess and say, Oh, am I too late? She just left at me. I said, Fuck. <laughs> And what happened was, like, the check-in was closed, but not the gate, so all the people waiting here, still waiting to board the plane. So yeah, I had a bit of a mild heart attack. <laughs> so yeah, uh, about 20 minutes and we'll board the plane. Then we go to Paris, Charles de Gaulle. So, in case you were wondering how Ljubljana airport looks like in Slovenia, there's forest, 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 mountains, 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 and you get some planes there <laughs> once in a while. <laughs> and the terminal is like literally not really busy. So, here in the terminal part, you only have the sitting area. As you can see, all is taken. So, just behind that glass window, there's like a duty free and a bar where you could see it. And that's where I've been sticking, sitting now for the last hour, drinking my wine and then running to the <laughs> counter there, thinking the boarding was closed, but only the check in was closed. So, yeah. Stupid job, stupid job. <laughs> No, but it's like uh, 20 minutes left to 
to boarding, so I think they should start boarding now. Any minute now, so yeah. Let's go to Paris. The plane from France have arrived. So there we go, Air France from Ljubljana to Paris as soon as they disembark we will embark <laughs> twenty minutes left until we board the plane people are starting to gather up And there's no place to sit. So Big Joe is standing and waiting. Made it through the gate. 16F. Last three years of the airplane. I go somewhere. So made it to a plane. I don't know how to go back there. Maybe follow these guys because my seat is in the back. So, yeah, Air France to Paris, Paris, Charles de Gaulle, and then we go to Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the plane that we're boarding. And that's me boarding the plane. <laughs> Made it to my seat. 16. Yeah. Full plane. Full plane. As I said, it's a full plane, so this might take half an hour to board. Again, I'm over the wing. So this is the view we are gonna get and before landing in Paris I hope we get some nice views of the Eiffel Tower and that's it guys stick around to see if I got that Eiffel Tower Follow the illuminated path and instructions from the crew Blackbird Les ceintures s'attachent, s'ajustent et se détachent de cette façon Just taxing to our takeoff point in the middle of forest and Slovenia. Now it is time for takeoff from Ljubljana Airport to Paris, Charles de Gaulle.
street on a French Air France uh, plane. We got a ham sandwich. We got a white wine. It's called Saint Cecile. And we got a red wine that's called Tour LED Tour de Milis. Cabernet Sauvignon Shiraz. I guess it's a mixture. So. Let's try those puppies up, and yeah, the view outside is not very nice, it's only clouds, probably raining downside, they're in Germany, but yeah, we'll try these puppies up and see you in Paris. So this is the sandwich we got, it's with ham, pork ham, and with butter. but not enjoyable. It's wine and drinking time. So we're trying Muscat Sauvignon Black. Sounds like Muscat. Tastes a little bit like Muscat. But it's sour. That's the Sauvignon part, I guess. Three out of five. Three out of five. There you go, Paris, France. The Seine, that's the river that goes there. Sena. Where's the Eiffel Tower? Where's the Eiffel Tower? We will find our Eiffel Tower. <laughs>
Ahead by the front exit. continue our journey towards Sierra Leone. Let's go. Take care. So, yeah, this is Paris, France. I'll try to get to a lounge here and then we'll go to the hotel. 
because I'm staying one night here. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. Pink, pink, pink. <laughs> He said text to me. <laughs> I'm Dutch guy from Netherlands. So yeah. Oh toilet. We don't need toilet. We need to get out of here. No, we need to go to airport airport launch, I think. And that's it. That's it. So if you like traveling and you enjoyed today's video, be sure to subscribe, like the video, and see you in my next one where I discover Charles de Gaulle. Oh, oui, 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 monsieur, monsieur, oui, oui, oui. <laughs> Take care, guys. So, yeah, guys, I made it to Paris Airport. No idea where to go now. No idea. I'm looking for the Star Alliance lounge, but who knows where it is? I see a bus there. Let's go ask. So, this is the thing here we see outside of airport in Paris. There's a bus here. Let's try to get on the bus. I hope it's free. It's free. It's free. Maybe it's free. <laughs>